Honey, I need to tell you something. What's wrong, babe? I've been trying to tell you this for the past week. What's wrong? You know you can tell me anything, right? I got a call from Lieutenant Wong. He wants me back for another term in Afghanistan tomorrow. Wait, you left for Iraq not even a year ago and now you're gonna leave us again? What are you gonna tell Ricky? Oh, how could you not tell me this? <laughs> I'm sorry. Watch your six. Watch your six. Rick, Timothy Wilson, you listen to your father. It's important. What do you want? Rick, I need to tell you something. What is it? I'm going back to Afghanistan tomorrow. Why? For another term. I just wanted to stop by to say um, bye and that I love you. You always have me when you have this by your side. Okay. I'll miss you, Dad. I'll miss you, too. Honey, why aren't you doing your homework? You know, you've been slacking a lot lately since your father left. Maybe you don't matter as much to me as Dad ever did, and you never will! Why would you ever say such a thing? <laughs> I'm sorry to inform you that your mom has passed away from the third treatment of chemo. And before she passed away, she wanted to tell you that there's a letter for you in the office and that she loves you. Hi, sweetheart. I know I should have told you sooner, but you were so upset about your father leaving, so I didn't want to make you any more upset than you were. I wanted to let you know I love you and you always have your father if you have the hourglass. It's not been easy for me. I'll go tell I'll go tell Rick right now. Mom, Dad. But why didn't they see me? Are they trying to tell me something? Is this a sign? Or was it hourglass? Will I have a second chance? Can I still see my mom? It's still confusing. Wait. I can save her. No! Hey, Tess. What's wrong? My mother passed away last night. Oh man, I know how you feel. I don't know how to feel because I've been really mean to her. Well, the only advice I can give you is you don't know what you have until it's gone. Now, let me tell you a story. 